U.S. President Joe Biden began his State of the Union address talking about freedom and democracy under attack, addressing the case of Ukraine. He called it not an ordinary moment in history, referring to the Second World War and comparing the war against Hitler with efforts to fend off Vladimir Putin's invasion of Ukraine. President Biden once again called on lawmakers to support a foreign aid bill that includes more assistance for Ukraine after months of delay. Political analyst Mykola Davidyuk, a director at Think Tank Politics, said while Biden's speech was received positively in Ukraine, Ukrainians are waiting for action. I think Ukraine was uh, one of the main topics and uh, and also now we are uh, waiting uh, from MPs that they will act or act after uh, his words, which was excellent. But now they need to support that words uh, with an action and uh, th th that is the expectation of Ukrainian people. On the streets, people are pleased that Ukraine was brought back to the spotlight, giving hope U.S. support will continue. Since he is the current president of the U.S., I think he has a certain influence. Thank you very much for the help they provide, have provided, and I hope will continue to provide. I think that Russia will do its best to delay this aid, unfortunately. But we all hope that the U.S. will still agree on this aid in the near future. Because we need it. We depend on it. Some were more skeptical. I don't think much depends on Biden's address, because there are still congressmen there. While Ukrainians continue to defend freedom and democracy on the battlefield, they are eager for actions rather than words, hoping additional aid from the U.S. will be approved before it is too late. Anna Chernikova, VOA News, 